Welcome back. This is Renee. And let's take a look and see what's going on with the DM. First of all, I've spoke with so many DFs. And <laughs> after talking with them, it's like seeing my story. Seeing the same thing that is going on just replaying a different picture different characters but the same right and and looking at the dm feeling his energy feeling just feeling it's like you can't escape their energy no matter what you do. Let's see what's going on in their life with them. Because I feel like you haven't had much contact. You haven't had a chance to really be around them maybe the way you used to. Or communicate the way you used to. And what you see on the outside. Isn't really what you're getting on the inside. Let's take a look. Hey. I've been wanting to talk to you, kind of touch base, but I don't know where to start, I don't know what to say, I feel really ashamed for the situation I put you in, and lately, This situation I've gotten myself into, I don't know how to get out of it. I feel like I'm falling deeper into something I don't want to be in. I see you or I hear your name. I see the car you drive. And... I think of you. It makes me want to talk to you. Want to reach out. And I know I'm with someone else right now. But they just don't understand me the way you do. I feel like I can't trust them. Like I can't open up. Like I can't. Be me. With you there was no pressure. There was no pressure to be honest. There was no pressure to. Be anything else but. Who I am. You. Didn't have the expectations that everyone else. Has with me. You kind of accepted me for me. And I don't know how you do it or why you do it. But I'm really cherishing the moments. I'm cherishing the time, right? The time I used to just get lost in looking into your eyes. And the beautiful smile that you would have while I'm looking at you. I could see so much love. And I was just totally amazed that 
you, someone as beautiful as you, could love me. Why? That's what I want to ask. Because it's not just your form. It's not just your curves. You are intelligent. You are beautiful, graceful. An incredible creature. One like I've never met. And I'm simply amazed. That. You chose me. I'm simple. Sometimes I'm not well put together. Although I try to be. I'm alright. Sometimes I need that ego boost. To make me feel better. And you, you, sweet lady, boosted my ego just by being around you. You made me feel incredible just by being around you. And I'm thinking back at everything that I did. Everything I need to work on. Frankly, all the lies that I told. I was never honest with you. I never told you exactly how I felt. Because what I feel can never be replaced no matter how hard I try. I'm learning that. I'm learning that the kind of love that you give, the kind of person that you are, the kind of intelligent conversation <laughs> like that I've never gotten before, and the big heart that you have, I like to think that I have that too. I try, I try to help people, I try to be there for people, and it seems like no one's there for me, so I kind of got used to that, kind of got used to taking care of myself, taking care of my needs in any way possible, being selfish, and looking out for me, ain't nobody else going to do it. So, I have to look out for me. But I think when I did that with you, I think I did a, I made a big mistake. I made a big mistake acting like that with you. You kept telling me that you see me, you understand me, and in a way I feel that you do, I feel like you understand me better than anyone ever has. But lately I feel like, I don't know, I, f I feel like you're talking about me. Why would you have anything nice to say about me after everything that I've done? And I feel like I'm being judged. I feel like, I feel like I messed up. I messed up so badly because in the past 
Ooh, they would talk about me. They would say some shameful shit about me. The rumors, the gossip, it would all come back to me. And I know you're not the same. I know that's not you. But I'm so scared that you will. And I don't think I can handle it. I don't think I can handle you thinking so badly about me. Feel like that would just break me in two. But I don't know what to say to you. So I just leave it at I hope soon things are going to change. I love you.